Well, it kind of sounded like springtime. But the truth is, seeing these bees buzzing around their hives, well, it happens on pretty much any warm day. But still, I was out looking for signs of spring, and there they were. It is a bit early to go looking for signs of spring, but I found these geese by Willow Creek, and, you know, they're paired up. And the snow, especially in southern Alberta, is melting away. It's nearly gone. And then this Chinook wind, well, that was taking even more away. But we are right on the doorstep of March, so despite this wind, there were at least a few signs of spring. Like these brand new calves at Granum Hutterite Colony. This little one was, oh, maybe an hour or two old. Mama was helping the little guy make his first few wobbly steps. That wind wasn't doing him any favors, though. Same with Cowboy Jerry Hofer here. He was moving the mamas to be into the calving pasture for the night. That wind was just tearing the grass up and throwing dust all over the place. It wasn't helping me either. I found these geese a little further down on Willow Creek, but I was really looking for more signs of spring. I'd hoped to find some gophers up running around, you know, Richardson's ground squirrels coming out of their hibernation. But that wind, the gophers are awake now, but that wind would have just blown them away. Kind of like the bottom of Mud Lake. Those 80 kilometer an hour winds coming off head smashed in were tearing up the bottom of the lake and sending dirt flying everywhere. It was fine silty dust that as soon as I rolled down the windows of the truck just got in everywhere. These horses were smart enough to take shelter. Well, most of them. This bull though, he didn't care. Made driving just a little bit interesting. But as evening came along, the wind died down and, well, it was just another lovely late winter day. So I didn't find all the signs of the oncoming spring that I'd hoped to. And the truth is, it's just the beginning of March, so maybe I jumped the gun a little bit. But our southern Alberta winter is winding down. And spring? Yeah, it's coming. <laughs>